It is day six of Vlogmas. As you can see, I'm feeling so much better. I've been doing a really good job. Listen, I told y'all I've been sleeping in until like 1 p.m. I have been eating my dinner and drinking my tea and taking my vitamins to make sure that I can nurse myself back together. And three days, baby, that's all it took. We back. I feel great. This makes me feel great because I love when I can just come on camera and just ah, 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 and be all like ah, 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 with y'all and not be all like... Ugh, like ew that's ugly we are finally gonna decorate this house okay so y'all seen in vlogmas day one i went and i bought this snow aka paint aka spray that i kept referencing it as when it was not it is snow and i'm thinking this whole elaborate thing first of all it's been raining non-stop so i'm thinking this whole elaborate thing like oh i can't do it inside the house i gotta go outside and do it because it's this and it's gonna stay my walls and my furniture and blah 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 girl it's snow it comes out like snow let me show you Do y'all see that? Oh, it got on my window. That's fine. Because all you gotta do is like scrape it off. It's literal snow, y'all. It's snow. It's like wet. I don't even know. We also have to go vote because unfortunately, Georgia's the only state that can't come to a conclusion on which one of these people to elect. I don't even understand how any of y'all think that, you know what, we ain't gonna get into politics. But my whole point is, I done did my deed as a U.S. citizen. And now you telling me I gotta go back out here and do it again? I mean, I'm gonna do it, but I ain't gonna like it. I'm gonna spray this tree white. We're turning this green tree white, baby. And while it dries, we can go out, boat, go to Target, return old boy, get new boy and then we gonna come back and figure it out i did not get those other bulbs online because y'all told me that they were the mini ones so we didn't get those but we still have these pink ones and i was thinking maybe we can do pink and white or the pink and gold that's not bad i knew y'all was smart it was something about y'all i knew from the very beginning <laughs> Okay, let's turn it around. Ah! You need to be plucked out a little bit, don't you think? You're looking a little skinny. Just a bit. Just a perfect. No big A. Okay, so you do need two cans. This is almost gone. Yeah. We're gone, honey. We're gone. Was I told multiple times to put something down so that this wouldn't happen? Yes. Did I listen? No. Let's move on. Okay, now that the tree is done, she has to dry. So we are going to head out before all the people that get off work heads out to go and vote. So it's 2.35, I should be back probably like four. Let's go. Okay, we voted. I hope y'all went out and voted too. If you did not, yes, I am judging you. The only time that I will judge you 
is today. <laughs> I'm about to head to Target, so let's go. Of course, there are no freaking white lights. Wow, this is truly amazing. <clears throat> truly. This is for outdoor use. Outdoor. Warm white. How much are these? And why is it open? They're huge. I don't want them that big. Okay, let's go. <laughs> All right, so we're leaving Target. They didn't have any lights. No white lights, anyway. Um, so I'm about to try Marshalls, but I'm low key scared because I don't, I don't even remember when I went inside of Marshalls. I don't remember them having Christmas lights. So I don't know, honey boo boo. Part of me wants to go to Family Dollar. Part of me is like, girl, I'm not finna drive all the way up there. Like, ew, walk. All right, let's go. Let's just go to Family Dollar real quick. Just real quick. Just real quick. We ain't kidding. Don't look at nothing. Don't think about nothing. Just go in there for the lights. All right, y'all. Back in the house. And let me just show y'all what I got. So, I got the bleach. Um, We got fabric softener we also got the stuff to make the mocktail which we're gonna make before we start decorating um so i'm gonna be making a peppermint espresso martini so i got some chocolate syrup we have some espresso we got some white chocolate and then we have some peppermint extract christmas lights now yes these are humongous we know this this is all they had so what do you want me to do? She looks good. Oh, it's dry. It's definitely giving stuff falling off of it. That's fine. We're not gonna judge you, girl, but you're a baddie. We are losing candy cane droppings left and right. Yum! Sarah, I mean, chocolate. Just pour a lot in there, being generous. Okay, let's do some honey. We're gonna pour our espresso shot in there. Some milk. Peppermint oil. Extract, not oil. Don't put peppermint oil in our stuff. I don't know how much. We just throwing stuff in there, y'all. That wasn't smart, was it? It wasn't, okay. I don't know what I was thinking, but just skip this part. Go straight to putting it in a shaker. Let's try her. Okay, okay. Not bad. I put some peppermint in it. I put the peppermint extract in it. That's for sure. <laughs> That's for sure. It's, the peppermint is just a very prominent. Maybe I put too much. Okay, let's go decorate this tree. Okay. Don't fall, Christmas tree. Let's be realistic here. Okay, let's unplug the girl. That's what she's all about. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? Frog. 
Swept over there for nothing. Who would have thought decorating would be tiring like this? Like, come on now, what the freak? And the balcony still is not done. It's dark outside, so we can't do it anyway. So I guess we'll do it tomorrow. Um, I don't know. You wanna say hi? <laughs> okay, y'all. Uh, I'm about to get ready for bed. Literally just finished editing this vlog. That's why it's going up so late. But don't worry, we'll get back on track with uh trying to just upload like during a normal hour, like five, six, seven o'clock. But yeah, I'm about to get ready for bed. About to get in the shower and hit the bed. So let's do that. Usually my nighttime routine is watching TV and chilling and just until I fall asleep. But I'm trying to be more cognitive about what I feed my brain before I go to sleep. So I picked up a new hobby, which is reading. And I luckily partnered up with the Dream app, who has so many different genres of books on their app that you can read. They have romance, paranormal, teen fiction, anything you could possibly think of, they have it. I've been super into the heroine book, so anything that involves like a woman just taking control of her life and like dominating the world, that's what I've been into. So I found the perfect book called The Perfect Luna. Um, it's basically just about like this heroine who found out that her husband was cheating on her and she kind of just like lost her identity and she took a second and bounced back and just like made this rebirth of who she was and what she wanted to do with her life. And I just really thought that resonated with me because I'm in this space of like trying to like rebrand my life and rebrand and rebirth who I am. So I've really been just in tune with this character and loving the book. Okay, and TMI, like I know, we all know this. I have really, really bad anxiety, like especially at night. Like I'm not that person that can just fall asleep and just like, I know I, I'm thinking about every last thing you could possibly think of, like what I have to do tomorrow, what I have to do in five years. like. Everything is just running through my brain. So I love that I can just like escape my own reality and just go into the dream app and read somebody else's like stuff. Like read about what they got going on and not about what I have going on. So the dream app just launched their dream feed your emotions campaign. So it's basically just to care for women's emotions because if nobody's going to care about them, we need to care about them. Um, so basically it's just to make sure that we are more in tune with our emotions and making sure that we are expressing them and releasing them in a more positive and healthy way this so is the way that i release my emotions in a healthy way at the end of my night i pour me up a glass of wine light my candle and pull out my dream app and just dive deep into my book so if you want to join along i will leave all the links down below in the description box so we can read together I hope y'all enjoyed this vlogmas. I'll see y'all tomorrow.